down. Now let me tell you more about VM1 sections. There are five of them. Node, Layer, Phrase Noise, Scaling and Input Settings. Node section controls parameters that concern a separate node, namely the depth of influence of the amplitude curve, wall EG, the depth of influence of the pitch curve, pitch EG, and the depth of modulation, vibrato. Of course, there are many more internal parameters, for example, for volume EG that would be attack time, decay, release, and sustain value. Same goes for pitch EG. For vibrato, such internal parameters are frequency, depth of frequency modulation and amplitude modulation, attack time, and some others. To simplify the use of VM1, the interface just has three sliders, allowing you to reduce or increase the influence of internal parameters. The section also has an indicator that shows the current value of valve EG. And, like all the other sections, Node section has a quick help, triggered by the question mark button and giving you the necessary information within the plugin window. To try the controllers of the Node section, it's better to use some effects style where the parameters are clearly expressed. For example, SO4 FX Biker Scream for HB01 Surge RRR Rock Tenor. Play notes from the keyboard while changing the parameters and you'll immediately notice their influence. Remember that the influence of parameters is different for each style. Layer section. Normally, VM1 uses three layers for synthesis, that is, three different wave samples. Layer section also includes parameters that concern synthesis of a separate node, but define the manipulation of the layers. Position sets the point between the layers from which the node synthesis starts. Layer EG defines the depth of influence of the envelope. In other words, how evident is the movement between the layers during the synthesis. And Sense defines the sensibility of position to velocity value. Or to MIDI controller CC11, if this is selected in input settings. The combination of these three sliders gives more possibilities to change the timbre of sound. To try the influence of layer section sliders, it's better to use a style with different vowels in layers. For example, PO2 Aum Choir per HB05 Martin UA Op Tenor. Play notes from the keyboard while changing the parameters and you'll immediately notice their influence. The indicator here shows the current point between the layers. Dump. 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 Dump.